Yo, what's going on? My name is Becker, also known as Prod Becker. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple evil plug type beat. This is what the beat sounds like. So yeah, very, very simple beat. Uh, everything in this beat is pretty much a two bar pattern. Uh, so I started off with this string preset from Purity. It's called Legato Hall. And this is the melody that it plays. So I'm in the scale of E flat minor. So I started on the root note and then I went up to the fifth, created this little 10 sounding chord. And then I went up to the six, so it has a little bit of change in the melody. And then I wrote this piano over top of that melody. Um, it's acoustic piano in purity. And this is the melody that the piano plays. So yeah, then it starts on the fifth of the scale, then it goes up to the root, comes back down to my sixth, and back again to my fifth, and then it repeats. Very simple, uh, just exercising that like semitone difference between my sixth and my fifth of the scale. And then I have this other like pattern that's made up of two purity instruments. Uh, they're both strings. This first one is legato strings two. It plays just the fifth of my scale. So just very simple strings in the background. And then I have this halftime synth string six. Uh, and it just plays the 6th to the 5th. Very, like, textural sound. I like to mix orchestral sounds with, like, pads and ambience. It, I think that's a good combination for uh, the Evil Plug kind of sound. And then I have another texture over here, uh, also from Purity. It's called uh, Temple Voices. And it just plays this little pluck on the fifth of my scale. And then to finish my melody off, I have this very common plug bell. It's called Vibra Hand Bell and Purity. It's super common in uh, plug music. It only plays one note, so this is what it sounds like. I actually had another note here, but I ended up taking it out. That's it for my melody. To move on to my drums, they're very simple as well. Here's what my drums sound like. So yeah, uh, I have this uh, hi-hat here. Just place a little three-step into a roll and then into another three-step. Uh, I have a chant. I have the shaker that sounds like a closed open hat. I have a clap. And a crash. And then a very, very simple 808 pattern. Stupid simple. And yeah, that's pretty much it for the beat. This was a very simple beat to be breaking down. So uh, I'm going to have some more complex breakdowns on the way. I just wanted to upload a little something for you guys. Yeah, that's pretty much all. I'm out of here later.